Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. There are multiple reasons to watch a K-drama. Some folks look for engaging stories, some go for the visuals or screenplay and some like me tap on it to watch familiar actors on screen. If we are talking about the real head-turning faces in K-drama, actor Kim So-hyun tops almost everyone's list. Kim So-hyun is one of the most highly paid K-drama actors in the industry. His spectacular performances in his roles shows he is deserving of every cent of his hefty paycheck. I mean, well, look at his face. And why not? This Basing Arts Award winning actor has starred in many and most cult classic K-dramas like Moon Embracing the Sun and My Love from the Stars whose viewership became a milestone in South Korea. His performance have always been eye-catching, be it his persona as a nurse in It's Okay Not to Be Okay, his small but memorable cameo in Crush Landing on You or his current role as a lawyer in the ongoing TV and K-drama Queen of the Stars alongside co-star Kim Jo-in, he has always been one star that people love to see on screen. Kim So-hyun is versatile and there is always something fresh in his roles. He is also reportedly one of the highest paid K-drama actors in the industry. His projects do not revolve around the usual romance and revenge plots only, which has helped him create a diverse fan base. There is a variety in his work and there is his pretty face as well, a wonderful combination. Kim So Hyun's passionate, precise interpretation certainly grant him that weight as a performing artist. From playing a musical genius to an ageless alien and a caregiver in a psychiatric ward, Kim So Hyun has showcased his versatility across genres. One of the most popular and soft after actors, he's also crowned king of commercials. Here's a look at a five Kim So Hyun's dramas which showcase his meticulous charm and acting powers. Before we go into the list, if you are watching this video without subscribing, please do take a minute and subscribe. It will be of great help. Number one in the list is Dream High. Song Sam Dong. Maybe the country bumpkin, but the boy has an innate talent for music. He lands at Kirin Arts School and meets Hai Mi, played by Bei Susi, and Jin Cook, played by Tai Xion, Pil Suk, played by Ayu and Jason played by Wu Young, the youngsters waiting to strike the right chord and make it to the world of music. Sam Dong is a simpleton. He is neither street smart nor calculating and he wears his heart on his sleeves. But one day when he realizes his element is serious, he may have to give up on his dreams and hopes of making music. But as this young boy challenges the odds to become one of the shining stars on the world stage, his is the story of perseverance and determination, a fight against all odds. Dream High is a story of aspiration, struggles, heartbreak and friendship. Kim So Hyun endures as Sam Dong and you cannot help but root for him to win. In one of the scenes where he helplessly wails as it finally registers that he could have well lost his hearing, you cannot help but feel his plight. Number two in the list is producers. Yet another Kim So Hyun drama about following your dreams is the producers. Seo Chan, played by Kim So Hyun, gives up what could have been a thriving and stable career in law and joins a broadcast station as a rookie producer. His reasons are pure and simple. He is infatuated with E Jin, played by Gong Hyo Jin, a producer of the show Music Bank, and he wants to work with her. Little does the gullible Seong Chan know that what goes on behind the scenes are very different from what he meets the eye. He also runs into the impassive Cindy, played by Ayu, a singing sensation who is cold and aloof. The producers give a fly-on-the-wall narrative of the lives of the many people who work in broadcast station as each one navigates a hyper-competitive yet merciless world of showbiz in a way they best know. They also learn some life lessons the hard way. Kim So Hyun is lovable as a wide-eyed and unassertive freshman who is willing to please. As he comes to terms with his feelings for Cindy, his awkwardness is adorable to say the least. Number three in the list is The Moon Embracing the Sun. When Yoon Wu, played by Han Ga in The Daughter of King's Advisor, marries Crown Prince Lee Ko 
Kwan, played by Kim So Hyun, the union sends ripples of discontent in the palace. Many, including the convening queen, see Yoon Woo as a thorn in their plans to wrestle control and they hatch a conspiracy. As Yoon Woo is anointed as the crown princess, the couple's happiness is short lived. It is alleged that Yoon Woon has come to her death from a mysterious illness. The heartbroken Lee Hwan is forced to marry another but refuses to consummate his marriage as he is unable to move on and continues to mourn the death of Yoon Woo. When he meets the shaman Wu who looks like Yoon Woo, he, it comes as a shock. In the meantime, Lee Hwan is caught in a battle of inheritance and discovers some shocking secrets. The moon embracing the sun is a perfect blend of history, fantasy, romance and tragedy. Kim So Hyun as the burden king gives a remarkable performance. On one hand, he is weighed down by the crown and on the other hand, he is empathetic, human, compassionate towards his people and pinning for the woman he loves. Number 4 in the list is My Love from the Stars. Kim So Hyun stars in Do Min Joon, a handsome and ageless alien who has inadvertently found himself residing on planet Earth for nearly 400 years. The man has no time for humans and their weird ways and keeps to himself. As he awaits to get back home to his own planet somewhere in the vast galaxy, he runs into Chan Song Yi, played by Jun Ji Hyun, a high-built movie star. Song Yi, on the surface, comes across as a temperamental and moody but at heart she's lonely lost soul. She ends up taking a class at the college where Min Joon teaches. One of his professionals where being an earthling, she also realized that he is her neighbor as well. Min Joon finds himself getting entwined in Song Yi's affair and is inevitable happens. The two fall in love but is imp but is it possible for an alien and a human to have a happily ever after or will the forces of nature play tron? My love from the star is a timeless appeal and remains an all-time favorite amongst fans. Jun Ji Hyun's iconic timing apart, Kim So Hyun has an undeniable charm as an resident, drop-dead, gorgeous, otherworldly being. His knight in shining armor acts in swoon worthy to say at least and their chemistry between the two leads make them one of the most endearing couples of all time. Number 4 in the list is It's Okay Not To Be Okay. Moon Kang Te, played by Kim So Hyun, is a mild-mannered and introverted caregiver at a psychiatric hospital. His main priority is his older brother, Sang Te, played by Oh Jang Si, an aspiring artist who is on an autism spectrum. However, their quiet life gets a jolt with an arrival of a trem temperamental and haughty Go Moon Young, played by Seo E. G. As the children's book author, Moon Young takes a fancy towards Kang Te and does everything possible to get close to him. She initially irks him and he tries to distance himself, but soon enough warms up towards this hostile young woman. It's okay not to be okay sensitively deals with issues pertaining to mental health and childhood trauma as well as unhealed emotional scars. Kim So Hyun's Kang Te is a young man who grew up well before time, given the situation with his brother. Kim So Hyun is exceptional as he articulates his character's dilemma and sense of responsibility as well as his own struggles. The intensity of his and Seo E.G.'s chemistry and underlying tension between the two is well articulated by both the actors and we can get some memorable quizzes in this drama as well. Number 5 and last in the list is the Queen of Tears. In his recent drama Queen of Tears, he plays Baek Hyun Woo, the Cinderella man in lieu of his marriage to Hyres Hong Hae In, Kim Ji Won, conflicting to his feelings towards his wife who blow both hot as well as cold. When he finally understands Hae In better, it seems there are several forces to play to keep the couple apart. Kim so ins on-screen presence and chemistry with Kim Ji-won have scorched their ratings and people cannot seem to get enough of the actors Kim si Hyun as Baek Hoon Woo and Ha In's husband and the legal director of Queen's Group. He was born in the rural area of Yongduri and became a lawyer after graduating from Seoul National University. 
Hong Wu, who is the pride of the village of Yungduri, is the legal director of the Clogromate Queen's Group, while Chabel hires Hong Hei In is the queen of the Queen's departmental stores. With this, we come to the end of this video. Which is your favorite Kim So Hyun character from the list in the video? Please leave your comments in the comment section below. I would love to hear from you. Well, if you like this video, please click on like, share and subscribe and don't forget to click on the bell icon. Please help this channel grow by sharing the videos with your family as well as friends. I'll be back soon with another interesting and unique video. Until then, stay safe, stay healthy, spread positivity and peace. Bye.